Welcome to Roscon Field Testing. What we have here is three separate products that we've taken samples from, from three different buildings. Uh, the first one we'll show here is expanded polystyrene, which you can see here has quite a distinctive color. It does come in various other colors, including gray, white, and a pink version. There are various uh, fire rated versions of this. Majority, however, unfortunately are not fire rated. As you can see, this sample here was core drilled. The external of the uh, uh, property had a render finish. So to the impression of the everyday uh, uh, purchaser or everyday person looking at the uh, building itself would think it may be brickwork. Behind it, you can see it's virtually a one or two mil render finish, which uh, over time would delaminate and fall off, exposing the EPS. Uh, there's no real fire protection between the um, uh, render to the EPS, and as such, uh, the EPS not being fire rated will go up in a heap of flames. A secondary product, another solution, which is about a 50 mil thick, is a product uh, known as QT. Basically, it's the same polystyrene bubbles, which you can see he through here, but it's mixed in with uh, a fibrous, um, uh, more like a fiberglass type uh, mix, uh, as well as concrete to give it a, a more sturdier and solid approach, as well as being fire retardant. The third product we have here is an aerated, um, more of a, a um, concrete uh, base without any fibers through it. Again, it's using a polystyrene type bubble. Uh, and again, it is uh, formed up uh, in a factory using different chemicals. These particular two products at the moment we'll test and you'll see they have a certain level of fire retardants. Uh, the concern would be the chemicals that are made up of these products may become toxic in nature. So if there is a, a, a burning flame beneath, the uh, uh, smoke of these may be fairly toxic and possibly cause um, uh, smoke inhalation or death as well. So not necessarily fire uh, danger, but certainly smoke related danger, as at this stage, the chemicals that are used are unidentified as to whether they are safe to handle. Uh, same in the process of cutting them, the fibrous nature, when you cut through, they'll have a series of uh, dust particles, which again may be uh, toxic in nature. Uh, just to show you how they operate here, we have this one here, which will run at a temperature of approximately 322 degrees Fahrenheit. As you can see here, as we burn it through, uh, it begins to uh, ignite, but no flame is evident. Uh, it's a little hard to see on the camera, but there is a fairly to toxic smell that can be smelt as it emanates uh, from the burning area. Uh, as you can see, it doesn't seem to burn up sideways or down. Uh, there's little to no flame at all. It's just an embering effect. Uh, but again, it will be that toxic smoke that may be of concern. As you can see there, it's smoking away. So if you were to have a fire beneath the panel, uh, you'd have a possible toxic uh, smoke scenario. Similarly with this other form of uh, what we we'll call aerated type concrete, we'll hit it again. And as you can see, similar effect, just an embering, no flame. But again, we're getting a very uh, pungent toxic smell um, throughout this uh, uh, testing area. Uh, again, there's no uh, evident flame running up, down or sideways. Uh, again, it's just an embering effect and again, uh, a positive in terms of being a fire retardant, but again, it'll be that toxic smell with the smoke you can see through there. Uh, to the most uh, commonly used and the cheapest form, um, expanded polystyrene. This one uh, we believe to be not fire rated. Uh, we're gonna test it now just to see if it is fire rated. Chances are it's not gonna be. So uh, full caution will be uh, adhered here. So we just run the, uh, oh my goodness, look at that. Oh, 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 it's all gone. And it's uh, unfortunately uh, ended our test uh, prematurely. Uh, we didn't have a chance to explain anything about it. There was no smoke residue. It was just a pure flame accelerated right through it. Thank you and have a great day.